There could be relief in store for those who've taken loans. PNB Housing Finance MD and CEO Girish Koski has, in an exclusive conversation with the Business Today Managing Editor Siddharth Zarabi, said that he sees interest rates dipping by a quarter of a percentage point in the next two to three quarters. The PNB Housing Finance CEO also expressed confidence that the realty sector was reviving. Here's an excerpt. What's your sense about the forthcoming quarters and link it to the overall sort of uh, trend that we are seeing, trends that we are seeing in the housing finance market? The market is quite robust. Real estate space is doing well since last uh, two and a half years. Uh, immediately after COVID, it started recovering. And I think till now, you no know, looking back, in spite of uh, interest rates going up you know, to an extent of 225 lips, the demand has not gone down. There has been you know, some reports on affordable uh, you know, demand slightly going down, but I think overall it's pretty good. And if you look at uh, this year as well, the industry in the range of 12 to 13 percent, and uh, we eight percent. And in terms of disbursement, uh, we two percent. What is the impact of the interest cycle that we have seen? Almost 14 months, uh, we've. 50 basis points increase in interest rates. Is that impact in the market? I think that of uh, no uh, interest rate hikes in construction cost. So increase in interest rate and increase in construction cost is deterrent to growth. So what demand we are seeing, what growth we are seeing, you know, at least last year what we saw for the industry was pretty good. So I think all that is baked in. So now uh, quarter one is typically muted because of the seasonality. Otherwise, the growth is uh, intact. Okay. Mm. Uh, what about pricing? Uh, since we are talking about the housing market, how much of that is a issue? We have seen prices uh, go up. Developers have claimed that input costs have uh, are partially responsible, uh, and especially in the metros, we are seeing a significant increase. Do you see uh, prices being a factor in the near term? And is there any sense that uh, you get that prices are going to uh, at least stabilize, if not drop? Uh, if you look at uh, the developer business, sale of flats, even that's on the uptick. So uh, construction prices have gone up. But that, that happened you know, in last about uh, 12 to 15 months time. So we've seen that last year. So in spite of that, we've seen a lot of developers putting up good numbers that had an impact. I think even that is absorbed. So I think going forward, at least the price should be stable. Uh, I think if everything uh, you know, uh, is where it is, as is, uh, the demand should be pretty robust and even uh, the developer fraternity will do well in terms of sale. And this is across all segments. And I just want a broader comment from you on the interest rate cycle that we have seen. Uh, there are signs that, you know, we could be in an extended pause and at some point circumstances may push the NPC to even consider a, a cut. What's your own sense about where the uh, interest rate uh, cycle is placed currently and what can we expect in the next six to nine months? I think the rates went up in last four to five quarters. So, so now it is a consolidation phase. Maybe for next two to three quarters, it will consolidate. It will remain where it is. And after that, probably it might start coming down. But I think it will start with 25 bips down. So I think for next three to four quarters, uh, you know, it's going to be a good story for uh, NBFCs and housing finance companies. Because uh, in the interest rate rising scenario, and the consolidation stage, I think uh, all the NBFCs and HFCs will do well. So, which is a little different vis-a-vis -vis compared to bank, but at least, you know, uh, non-bank would do well, you know, with the interest rate increases. When I say increase, not substantially, I think to a certain extent. And uh, during the consolidation stage, uh, you know, HFCs and uh, non-bank companies would do well. So, I think uh, given that, uh, uh, in that context, next few quarters are going to be really good for uh, uh, the space.